Question, have you ever walked into a room and instantly liked someone without knowing why? You might say it's because of their smile, their voice, or how they carry themselves, but science says that you are using almost all your senses to decide who you like whether as a friend or romantic partner. A 2025 study explored how people judge others' attractiveness across multiple senses, link to the study is found below. Physically and mentally healthy participants in their early 20s were selected for the study. Most were heterosexual, but a range of sexual preferences was included 61 participants, 34 women and 27 men, acted as nonverbal agents. These agents were recorded while speaking, photographed, and asked to walk up and down stairs to produce sweat samples. Another group of 71 people, 37 women and 34 men, acted as perceivers. Each perceiver rated eight people, four men and four women, on how attractive they found them based on their face, voice, body motion, and body odor. Here's what they found and why it matters for you. First, multisensory impressions matter the most. The most attractive ratings came from audio video clips, where perceivers could both see and hear the person. Thus, if you want to make a good impression, a Zoom call or a face-to-face -face conversation is far more effective than a phone call. Second, looks aren't everything. While facial features still matter, your voice and how you move contribute significantly to how attractive others find you. A confident voice tone, relaxed posture, and natural movement can elevate your overall impression. Third, your sense says a lot. Body odor turned out to be the least attractive sense on average, but it still matters especially in close or long-term connections. Your scent is influenced by your immune system genes, hormones, and your diet. Therefore, take care of your personal hygiene and diet to improve your scent. Fourth, attraction is personal. There's no one-size-fits-all beauty. Personal preferences, especially in same-sex ratings, mattered more than shared standards. This means what works for one person might not work for another. Thus, be authentic. Focus on being your best self rather than chase trends. Being liked isn't about being the most average or perfect, it's about expressing who you are. Finally, attraction affects more than romance. Even when rating people of the same sex, where there's little romantic interest, people still judged attractiveness and it influenced who they want to be friends with. That's because being attractive makes you seem more trustworthy, interesting, and likable. Thus, the next time you are meeting someone new, remember that your face, your voice, how you move, and even how you smell are all telling a story. Make sure it's a story that feels real, confident, and uniquely you. Question for you, what do you find most attractive? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to stay at the cutting edge of psychology.